Debbie, and today I'm going to talk about babies playing with blocks. Blocks are classic toys, and often among a child's first toys for good reasons. Playing with blocks provides babies with mental stimulation and helps them develop fine motor skills and hand-eye coordination. It helps them understand spatial relationships. Blocks are simple toys, but the more a toy does, the less your child has to do. With blocks, the possibilities are endless, and how they are played with changes over time. Babies will be at the very earliest stages of block play. Babies explore blocks and their physical qualities by pushing, grasping, feeling, shaking, banging, carrying, mouthing, and dropping them. They will also start to transfer them from hand to hand and may stack a few, either vertically or line them up horizontally. These silicone blocks are great for grasping and mouthing. These blocks are also good for little hands to pick up and they feature surfaces with different textures. These blocks are fun because they have movable parts, they have graphics that are high contrast. Um, they have different fabric textures on each side of the block. They have fun sounds that differ also. And of course, there are wooden blocks. The usage and benefits will grow with your child. Be sure to check the age recommendation for each set. Alphabet blocks usually say they're for ages one and up or two and up. Babies may not be at the developmental level um, to receive the most benefit from them yet, but it's still okay for them to play with them. Toys that are labeled ages three and up, however, um, should not be given to babies because they present a choking or some other safety hazard. Once you provide the toys, the most important thing that you can do to nurture your baby's learning through play is to play with your baby. Research shows that babies play longer and develop better play skills when their grown-ups play with them. It builds their confidence and problem-solving skills. Stack one block on another and encourage your baby to try. Resist always doing it for them. Providing just enough help to keep your baby from getting frustrated will motivate them to learn new skills. Demonstrate things like banging two blocks together, um, putting them in containers, and dumping them out. Try these things for a few minutes, day after day. Repetition is the key to learning. Eventually, your child will move into more and more complex stages of block building, and the two of you will share many fun play times along the way. Until next time, happy building!